Okay, so this is being called a miracle cure. This little girl named Ani used to suffer from 60 seizures a day. Now that number has dropped to almost zero. Ani lives in Brazil, but I learned this week how her savior was in San Diego. In this Brazilian documentary, Katiel Fisher explains how her daughter Ani started having aggressive epileptic seizures when she was three. The family never lost hope despite the sadness. Exactly essa esperança. That hope led her to this Facebook page created by a Dallas mother whose little girl also suffered from debilitating seizures. It was very hard. Penny Howard and her family found a cannabis-based product in San Diego that worked wonders for their daughter. It was a big deal because now we had our kid. We had our daughter. The Howards became a source of strength for the Fishers in Brazil. But the challenge for the Fisher family is that in Brazil, any product made of cannabis was illegal. Desperate, the family illegally imported it. Brazilian customs caught on, and that led to a court case. The Fishers testified that product kept Ani alive, decreasing her seizures from 60 times a day to almost zero over a few months. The Brazilian government ruled it would be inhumane to keep it from little Ani. The Fishers set a precedent by changing the law. This is the product that families are calling a miracle cure. It's called Real Scientific Hemp Oil, and the company that makes it is right here in San Diego. And so I'm putting it on my uh, finger here, and then uh, from here I'll just place this uh, under my tongue. Dr. Stuart Titus shows how easy and safe it is to take hemp oil for epilepsy and other disorders. He oversees Medical Marijuana Inc., the first publicly traded company of its kind. The level of THC is very, very minimal. And the first to work exclusively with Brazil, which has agreed to allow these products into the country because of the fissures. Brazil's landmark decision opens up a multi-million dollar hemp oil pipeline from San Diego. San Diego is really becoming a major center for the development of these wonderful CBD-based products. And Dr. Titus says that Brazil has agreed to pay for the hemp oil product for about a thousand patients. And in a few months, the Fishers and Howards plan to meet for the first time here in Southern California.